Hello, Longer Burger friends. How are you? How's your week going? Today is Thursday, obviously, and so is our opportunity to talk about Thursday trends. My name is Lisa, and I love Thursdays because the topic is always going to be a little bit different, and I feel like when I watch Thursday trend, I learn things, and then I'm kind of inspired to know more about it. So today's Thursday trend is not just focusing on jewelry, but focusing on kind of the history and the relevance of baskets and basket making. I mean, obviously, Longer Burger started as a basket company. That's where the whole thing started in Dresden, Ohio, many, many decades ago. But long before Longer Burger was doing baskets, baskets were here. They've been around pretty much as long as man has walked this earth. And the baskets have been found in the pyramids. Baskets of every type of material have been found and preserved. That's why they are in museums, why people love to collect them. And I find that it's so interesting because... When you think about in the earliest days, baskets were woven for a very specific purpose. They were functionally necessary in the civilization. So for the carrying of food, for the carrying of other provisions, some baskets were woven so tightly together they could literally carry water. And so when you think about the history and how long they've been a part of our lives, we realize that from inception, they were absolutely necessary for everyday life and to get through everyday life. Kind of fast forward to where we are today. Do we love baskets? We do love baskets. Do we have to have them in our life? Some people really do. But now they're more of a just a wonderful, iconic symbol and design that's so pleasing to the eye that we love to wear and adorn ourselves with. So that's the reason I love Longerberger jewelry. And you know about jewelry, do you? I want to start first with how it comes to you, and it's just a beautiful a box presentation, that kind of velvety olive green I'm in love with, longer burger emblazoned across the front. So whether you're looking at the charm bracelets, the charms, or what we're going to be talking about today, all of the longer burger basket woven items are pristine. I love the little pouch that it comes in so that when you're not wearing your jewelry, you can put it back and it can be safely kept until the next time you do want to take it out. So let's talk about the basket we design and some of the items that I want to share with you today. First things first, I love Longerberger jewelry because it's just fantastic. 925 silver and then rhodium over the 925 silver. So what I have today are two different pair of earrings. I'm wearing one, but I'm going to show you these. Can you see these beautiful little tiny buttons? I love this earring because it's diminutive and yet it has a bold statement. Intentionally oxidized, you can see that basket weave design. There's your butterfly clutch and your post in the back. So that if you're looking for something a little bit more, I guess, business-like or daytime, these earrings are absolutely perfect. And they feel really good on. They're smooth across the top. They just look very, very, very elegant. Now, I am wearing, take it off in this ear. Sometimes it's better on this side. I am wearing a beautiful J-hoop. When you look at it from the side, you can see why it's called a J-hoop. When you look at it from the front, it actually looks like it's three hoops in one. It's not. It's one solid piece. And then right in the center is where you can see the basket weave design. Now, remember, this is 925 silver, rhodium over the top of it. And, you know, we've talked about jewelry before. If you're going to make a design into a jewelry item, you're going to actually etch into the metal. You have to make sure that metal is substantial enough so that you can make the design and then you can intentionally oxidize it and it won't harm the item. In other words, if you didn't have enough metal and you tried to etch into it, the metal could crimp or it could dent or it could bend. And then you would have a, a misshapen earring. Not so with these. They are so substantial and yet they're so very, very comfortable. So earrings with our basket weave design, when you just think about it, it just is so familiar and it's so beautiful and we it, it's iconic. Uh, some people will think of it as almost town and country because there is that very elevated town and country aspect you think of with a basket weave. Others will feel that it's very contemporary. I feel like it's really rooted in traditional kind of jewelry designs, but I think it appeals to all of us. Now, I know what you're looking at, these rings. Let's continue the conversation about basket weave design. This is called the signet ring, and I absolutely adore it. Look at this. On the table is that beautiful basket woven design. It's really flat across the top, so it's really super, super smooth, and then it tapers down at the back. It can be worn on any finger. I just think it looks wonderful. I chose this one for like the middle finger because I think it has a very bold statement, and I love the way it pairs back with 
this little earring. So if I was going to do this collection, I would probably do the signet ring with the more diminutive little button earring. I just think that because they're both kind of circular in nature, they look really dynamite together. But you can mix and match in any way you want. And I think the thing that I love about the Longa Burger jewelry collection is that it really can be dressed up. I mean, this is very substantial silver that you're wearing. And so if you want to pair it with platinum or even your white gold, you could do that and it would look just beautiful together. If you have a favorite blazer that has like kind of like a, a white gold or a silver you know, button to it or a favorite pocketbook that has all of the hardware in silver. This is so elevated because it, it is. And then the fact that it's intentionally oxidized gives you that, that texture and that contrast. I love that because it just looks really, really elegant. The other ring I want to tell you about is this one. I love this band ring. A lot of people call this a cigar band style ring. It's just a beautiful band ring. That design goes all the way around the side and then all the way to the back where you have a solid piece of silver. Okay, that's the back of the ring. Now, I will tell you a little secret. Some people, and I, th I think there would be zero wrong with this if you wanted to do it, choose to wear it this way, and then they have an initial engraved on the silver. I have heard of people doing that. I think it would look really pretty. The intended way to wear it is like this. So the back of it is back here. That could even become a sizing bar if you needed to size it down a little bit. But I just love the design of it and how, I don't know, it just, it's beautiful. Look at the thickness of it. See what I'm saying? Because there is heft to this, it's not heavy, but because there's a substantial amount of metal, you're able to get that design work etched into the metal and then oxidize it so that you really can see it very prominently. I would probably team this ring with this J-hoop. I just think they're bolder. I think they look really, really great together. And that's the whole idea of Longaburger jewelry. I mean, you can really mix and match it within its collection. But then if you already have a great collection of silver that you love to wear, or alternatively, here's an idea. If you have a lot of onyx, because onyx, as you know, is a natural origin gem and it's black. Um, there's also black spinel. So there's gems and there's black diamonds. If you have other jewelry items in your jewelry box that have a black presence to them, they could work really beautifully with these. Mixing and matching, I mean, that's what our jewelry collection is all about. We know if you're watching or you're looking at Longaburger jewelry, you have jewelry. You probably have a lot of it. You've got great jewelry, I'm certain. But what we want to do is offer the opportunity to just kind of mix and match in some of these beautiful pieces from Longaburger. So don't forget about our little button earrings. I adore those. The J-hoop both rings, all of them with the basket weave design, which has been with us forever and ever and ever and started as something that was necessary to live life and now has morphed into a design that we love adorning ourselves with because it just looks so beautiful. These are beautifully made. They're going to stand the test of time. You will pass these down from generation to generation. It's all longer burger. The legacy of this brand is phenomenal. So I hope today, this is Thursday, and we are doing Thursday Trend. I hope you will let a longer burger basket weave design jewelry item become your trend this week. I know you'll enjoy it. I'll see you next time. Thanks so much, guys. Have a great rest of your week.